I have a great tasting holiday smoothie for you. Um, in the fall, when it gets colder, I like to drink like pumpkin spice lattes. So I'm gonna make a pumpkin spice smoothie for you today. Uh, a couple things that we're gonna use, obviously water and ice, depending on the texture, how you like your uh, smoothies, uh, thicker or thinner, um, depending you know on the ice that you wanna use. Um, flax oil, flax oil actually is really great for your heart connective tissue, it's a good fat. So you wanna make sure and get good fats in your diet because that's gonna lower your cholesterol. It's also good for your hair and your skin and your nails. Also, cinnamon. Look for the USDA label that says that it's certified organic. And I like to use allspice. You can also use um, pumpkin spice seasonings or whatever fall-like seasonings that you like, allspice. So, and then also pumpkin. Um, Make sure it's organic. Make sure when you look on the back of the pumpkin that you get that it says 100% pumpkin and there's no added sugars or anything in there because you just don't need that, so. All right, Sun Warrior Protein is a protein that I like to use because it's raw, it's vegan, and it's plant-based. We're always trying to get more plant-based uh, ingredients in our diet, so we're gonna use that instead of a whey protein or even a soy protein um, just to mix it up and just get something different in your diet, so. All right, Magic Bullet is what I like to use. It's fast and quick and easy, and there's no extra cleanup, so it's pretty fast, so. We're gonna use water first. I like to put my wet ingredients in first because it helps with the mixing. We'll use the pumpkin. Again, use as much as you want. I like a lot of pumpkin in mine. We'll add the oil, about a tablespoon is good for each serving. So I'll eyeball that. Dash your spices. When you put your wet ingredients first, and then you put all your dry ingredients on top, with the Magic Bullet, I've just found that it just mixes a lot better, so. And you're getting about 20 grams of protein. So you wanna get between 15 and 20 grams of protein at your meals, so make sure that uh, when you look on the back of whatever you use, uh, Sun Warrior is what we use, uh, that you're getting about 15 to 20 grams of protein per scoop. If you don't, then you just wanna add another scoop. We're gonna put our chopping blade on there. comes with these mugs with the handle on there. Ooh, it looks spicy. Let's see all my spices on top. Put the protective lip on there. Mm. That reminds me of Christmas. 